Man, yes, sir, man. I couldn't even make a, a short on this. I had to do it like a full five minute video on this. And this ain't the Tennessee video that I'm finna do right after this. This, <laughs> cause the, them Tennessee fans, don't ghost me. I know y'all gonna ghost me, but I'm gonna put it up there anyway. Cause it gotta be said, and George fans will come on it and uh, whatever. But Tennessee fans, don't ghost me. But this is strictly LSU versus Alabama. Man, I fell asleep in the first half. You know, I was, I was wild out for the George game. You know, I was, I was talk going backflip, you know, I'm going no backflip B way. I mean, the score was like six to six in the first half, man. Or something like that. I can't even remember. First quarter, first half. I fell asleep. You know, either way, you know, I wake up and I was like, man, some time I wake up, you know, I'm waking up. And I'm like, man, the game got good, like 14, 13, something like that. I can't even remember 13. Either way, nonetheless, so I'm watching the game. So, you know, I'm like, man, I got to go to the gym. It was like 11 o'clock almost. It was like 10, 45, 10, 50. So I'm driving and trying to watch the game at the same time. Drive, watch the game. You know, then it was like, you know, they had, Bama, Alabama had got in, got in field goal kid overtime. I was like, all right, man. You know, I was like, oh, Alabama finna win. Huh? Still, you know, it looked like it. Alabama scored touchdown. But Jaden Daniels on the very first play, running in for a touchdown. Yeah, I, I feel like, I was like, you know what? Brian Kelly, knowing how Brian Kelly is, he was gonna go for two. He was gonna go for two. And I'll be dog, he did. He brought his pals, or you know what. He brought his big boy, you know what. You know, and put him home. <laughs> and they got a dog. Chaney Day, you got, I told y'all. I said it. Did I not? Did I not tell y'all this? Man, y'all be listening to these sports analysis dudes with statistics and trying to sign all smart, like Joel Clatt. And the Jordan Rogers dude who said George didn't have no talent on offense. Or they have I'm gonna I'm get to that. I'm gonna speak this, this I'm gonna get to that. That's gonna be my next video to talk about. But dude, like I said, I was like, Alabama again. I, I said oh, I said Alabama Ohio State wasn't gonna live up to the hype. So far, Ohio State, you know, they still in the playoff race. And they they won't stay in the playoff race. Because you know they 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 are they on the hardest game is Michigan now. I said like Alabama Ohio State wasn't gonna make the playoffs. People laugh and call me crazy. Uh, all season. You know, it was down in Georgia. It was like Alabama and Ohio State, by far the best teams, you know, the two best teams. Then there's a gap with Georgia and all this. I'm talking about Clemson next. Clemson, Clemson got embarrassed. You know, by Notre Dame. I don't even know if that's worth talking about. You no, know, I might do a short on that. You know, because I ain't watched the game. I don't really like talking about stuff. I ain't watched the game. But it really ain't no self, you know, it's self going to I said Clemson gonna lose. Notre Dame, you know. Either way, unless Alabama LSU, man. Alabama at LSU crowd rocking. You know, Bryce Jones uncomfortable being in the pocket. He missed on some throws from the pressure. Jamil Gills will continue to be the only weapon that's worth mentioning on Alabama, like I said. You know, I said, I like, you know, Gills the best weapon, you know, on Alabama. You don't need more than that, you know. Alabama didn't have no dominant rival receivers this year. Uh, you know, this is supposed to be the best Alabama team under Nick Saban, and it crumbled. You know, already out of playoffs. In the first week of November, you know, salute that and shoot. When them boys play hard, they fall in. You know, you know Florida State, they, they dominated Miami. Well, that's straight embarrassed Miami the game like that. It was 31 or three and a half time. You know what? But, you no, know, it, it didn't. And this game could have been so. If Florida State didn't beat, if LSU didn't lose to my at Florida State, man, it was like, think about it. You would have possibly had one loss LSU, maybe going into the SEC Championship and play Jordan. And Tennessee season not over yet. That's luckily by Tennessee. So. This season not over yet, thanks to Alabama. You know, if Alabama won out, beat Georgia as a championship, this season been over with. But, you know, but man, Alabama, let me know what y'all think, man. I couldn't even do a short on this. I had to do a whole video. I'm trying to do it under 10 minutes because Tennessee versus Georgia video might be 30 minutes long. How delusional. I, it, it's so many. I, I mean, I understand, though. 
Because, you know, Michigan fans was very delusional, too. You know, they was talking about, you know, I was subbing hillbillies and all that, you know, and, and trailer parks and all that uh, stuff outside of football. But, uh, you know, we don't play Michigan. You know, they ain't not in our conference. And Tennessee fans, man, y'all took it up a notch. Y'all, y'all, I mean, yeah, I'm going to get on that. Either way, congrats to LSU, you know. I always had wanted to get LSU. You know, that's one team I want to beat so bad because they, every time, you know, the past two times they played us, they straight embarrassed us, you know, in 2018 in Death Valley and in the SEC Championship, back-to-back -back years. I, I, ooh, I want to beat LSU so bad. And I, we finally might get the chance to 45 to 24 LSU this year, you know, in the SEC Championship game. Yes, sir, man. This season looking good, man. We ain't got Alabama worry about. I mean, so really, I mean, we, we got to handle business versus Mississippi State, then Kentucky, man, and, and, and Georgia Tech, and probably LSU most likely. You know, I mean, I doubt Ole Miss beat Alabama now. Nah. Like, I said it. I was like, LSU, either Alabama's going to lose to LSU or Ole Miss or Georgia. And it just so happened they lost to LSU. But let me know what y'all think, man. Hey, congrats to LSU. It was a good win. I mean, y'all brought it. Hey. Brian Kelly so far, man, you know. Hey. Did his thing, man. He, he regrouped after the, L the FSU loss and, and Tennessee beating. You know, he took. But hey, man. Georgia up next, though. Y'all make it. I mean, yeah, we, we hungry. You know, but we gonna see LSU versus Georgia, man. Let's get it. Part three.